Hello guys, welcome to my YouTube channel Easy Tech. Today we will see how to attach extra disk to our previously created virtual machine. Uh, let's suppose uh, we are ran out of storage on our <coughs> uh, recently created virtual machine. So how to attach an external hard drive or virtual hard drive? So let's begin our tutorial first uh, we will go to setting and here we will see scsi controller <coughs> there are two types of controller the first one is ide controller and the second one is scsi controller the ID controller just for generation one virtual machines, but the SCSI controller support generation one and also generation two virtual machine. I have created a generation two virtual machine, so um, my setting shows SCSI controller. If you guys have showing ID controller, so do not worry because you have generation one virtual machine. Uh, ID controller have two controllers two devices per ID controller you can attach in SCSI controller you can attach 64 devices per SCSI controller and we have four SCSI controller in our virtual machine you cannot modify ID e controller uh, but in SCSI controller, if you have SCSI controller, you can modify while your virtual machine is running. But in IDE, you have to shut down your virtual machine, then you can modify and add extra virtual hard drive. So, <coughs> we are clicking SCSI controller and then hard drive and then add so uh, as i have discussed we can attach 64 devices so zero it is starting from zero and ending to 63 we are using location two um, so click on new because i am creating new uh, and you can also uh, attach uh, previously created virtual hard disk so click on new and uh, the wizard box dialog box shows so click next uh, I am selecting dynamic dynamically expanding option you can also select this fixed size uh, if you select this option it will create a virtual hard drive with occupied space on your host hard disk so you cannot use that space if you will select this option this will create your virtual hard drive uh, with minimum size uh, when it uh, requires its original size it will expand its size <coughs> so you can utilize that space on your host and also you can give that space to other virtual machine if this virtual machine requires this size then it will expand and use on host machine the third one is differencing uh, it is parent child relationship so i am selecting dynamically next so you can give it name <coughs> extra hard drive you can also give their space uh, location where you want to store this virtual hard drive files next I'm giving 5 GB so next and finish click apply and then ok so we have created our virtual hard drive so 
So here we are on our virtual machine. I will show you whether it is connected or not, attached or not to our virtual machine. So go to disk management. Yeah, here you can see I am selecting GPT and click OK. New simple volume, next, next. I'm sure you have the experience to create new disk in disk management so it is online here you can see we have created our 5 GB virtual hard drive 